This is Chris Whalen, CPA, and welcome to the Street Level Business Podcast. My CPA firm specializes in business and individual income taxes. If you would rather read this podcast, there is a text version of it. There is a link to that text version above this video if you're watching on my blog page or in the description if you're watching on a video sharing platform. If you find this podcast informative, please take a moment and share it with your networks and contacts. Today's topic is, be careful to not include PPP loan proceeds as income on your tax returns. Many people had their PPP loan proceeds deposited into the bank account they use for business operations. This made perfect sense. But when doing their taxes, they simply add up the total deposits made into that account and treat that as total business income on their tax returns. You can see how this will overstate your income as the PPP loan proceeds are not taxable to you. If you do your own taxes, which is the worst idea ever, take extra time this year to analyze what figure you should be using as total business income. Make sure your accountant takes their time to only include deposits that are valid business income from clients and customers. If you don't use my firm for tax preparation, I urge you to schedule an initial consultation with me to give me the chance to showcase what we offer that other firms do not. This brings us to the end of this edition of the Street Level Business Podcast. Questions? Concerns? Call me on 732-673-0510. Thanks for listening. I hope you found this podcast informative. If you want to become a subscriber to my business and tax memos, please send an email to chriswhalencpa at gmail.com and I will add you. Remember, the moment you have a business or tax question is the moment you should be calling me. Have a great day.